call this peace. Oh, just your nipple. You're not a fucking treat. Have you guys ever had one of those days where you wake up, grab your phone, blink for 0.2 seconds, then realize you already wasted half your day? Because literally, same. If you want to see how I make the best of my half-wasted day, then continue watching. It's, it is 1.48 p.m. I decided to put on my camera and start talking and hopefully save the day and, and also not look like this by the end of the video because what is this? I literally just woke up. I'm feeling crusty, dusty, dusty. Look, I'm still on my phone. I'm trying to say that my screen time has not been that bad. You're supposed to identify as what you want. So I don't identify as a person who is on my phone for a long time. Also, I don't get on my phone anymore. I don't use social media anymore. And I am so much happier because of it. Well, anyways, I need to start my day. Okay. I'm going to make my bed. eyebrows first when the hot cheeto girl phase was trending imagine if i knew how to do makeup back then how i do now oh my gosh but you can't be reminiscing like that because no regrets you know why be a bad bitch then we could be a bad bitch now you know what i'm saying plus it wasn't gonna work because i was so sad in high school this is getting too deep but yeah i was like really not in a good mood all the time i think the best thing i learned is growth the point of life and um human existence is evolution you need to get better you need to evolve you know what i'm saying you know oh just your nipple it's really random but one of my goals for this year is to become a better speaker but I don't know if you can tell but I'm not that good at speaking and also I slur my words a lot. Funny because I actually kind of want to be like a speaker when I, I was going to say when I grow up. I'm already grown. I'm literally, I just bought a dictionary because <laughs> I need to get better. So I'm sorry. Dino is breathing so hard. It's just, there's nothing wrong with him. That's just how he lives. I know like my life seems boring but I call this peace it's it's still chaotic because I am very much a chaotic person literally living my best life right now and it's all like everything that I did is all mental like I am thriving I am so much happier because I know that I am improving all aspects of my life, which is why I've been so happy. You get me? Back then, when I didn't know how to make goals, like, obviously, I had goals for myself. But, like, when you're young, you're just living your life, like, day to day, and it's going to get boring. You don't have anything to aim for, and you need to trigger some drive in you, you know what I'm saying? You need, like, to pursue something. You kind of want to, like, chase something. Otherwise, you just, you're just like there. Like, why would you want to be there? Like life is all about suffering. Why would you just want to sit and suffer? Just move and suffer. At least you're going somewhere. You're not a fucking tree. Oh, yeah. Back to the topic about you're not a tree. I think it's better to be aggressive about the life that you live than not to have, not having the will to live. Cause that used to be me in high school. And I just did not want to be there. Like, even if you don't know your purpose or your mission, um, one of the best things I heard was from Steve Harvey. I'm paraphrasing. But the thing that you do best is link to your gift. You may not have talent, but it can literally be your personality. Like, for example, me. I'm very sensitive. And that's not a talent. But I'm also really good at making people spill 
and giving them like an emotional breath you know like letting them just talk about their their emotions and i don't know what like type of career that would be right now but i know i care a lot about other people something that's really helpful is just the principle of doing something just doing something because once you start doing anything it creates momentum so then you keep going and then it doesn't feel like you have to put effort into doing something you know because you already put the effort and it's like pushing a car not a car it's too heavy pushing like a toy car <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry if Dino is like di like distracting you from me, <laughs> but I feel bad if I make him go somewhere else, so he's gonna stay here with us. I don't know if you can tell by how jittery I am. It's literally not the case. I'm just naturally a very anxious person and I'm trying not to express or like show that through my many months later my body language I'm trying not to show that through my body language because I want to say a lot of things but I do not know how to express things the way I want to what type of Damn shot, it's already 3.30. Everybody tell me I talk too much. And now I see it. I know you're thinking, Amy, you look so hot right now. Where are you going? I'm literally about to just clean up my mess in my room. some gratitude journaling affirmation meditate and just like make myself feel better 